In this short video, we're going to go and look at a little bit of the theory behind drug trialing and how that theory can be used when answering an exam question. <clears throat> so, the best way to use this video is to start off, download the question uh, following the link in the description below. Make sure that as the video is going on, you're pausing it and writing down key points as you need them. Go through, maybe answer the shorter questions first, and then use those answers to the short questions in order to go and answer some of the longer answer questions. So, drug trialing are needed to go and test drugs to make sure that they are safe for humans to use. So the drugs are firstly tested using computer models and skin cells grown using human stem cells in the laboratory. So this allows any possible side effects and toxicity to go and be looked at. So many substances fail this preclinical trial because it doesn't seem to work on the cells or in worst cases it goes it will go and kill the cells off. Drugs that pass the first stage are then tested in the second part of the preclinical trials on animals. Right, so in the UK, medicines have to undergo these tests. Um, it's illegal for cosmetics and tobacco products to be tested in this way now. So a typical test involves giving a known amount of a substance to an animal, usually a small mouse or a rat, and monitoring the side effects. We go and use mice and rats because they are genetically very similar to humans. So drugs that have passed animal tests or animal trials then go on and move on to human trials. So they are tested on healthy volunteers to check that they are safe. The substances are then tested with people with the illness to see the dosage that they work at. <clears throat> So, if we actually go and look at how drugs are trialled over time. So, the time in years shows how long it takes for the drugs to be trialled and what phase the trialling the drug will be in. So, many questions will often talk about the time scale. It takes a very, very long time to go and test drugs. So we start off with preclinical testing, right? This is to find out if the drug is toxic and if they work. Drugs that pass that then go into phase one testing. This uses somewhere between 10 and 100 volunteers. We use low dose dosages and look for side effects. After that, we move on to phase two testing, where we use about 200, 400 volunteers and we use this to work out what dosage of the drug needs to be given to a person. Phase 3 involves 3,000 plus volunteers and involves giving half of them a placebo. So all placebo really is, in the terms of what we're looking at, is a fake drug. So it's a drug that's not going to have any, any medical effects. So during phase three trial, a blind or double blind experiment is used, right? So this is an experiment in which information about the test is masked, so hidden from the patient to reduce or eliminate bias. So nobody knows whether they've been given a real drug until after the trial. After this, the drugs can then go on sale, <clears throat> but they will still be monitored for a few years. So, one type of question that looks at drug trialing will go and give you a series of information about a particular drug that people have trialed. So, in this one, it says scientists have tried a new statin drug. It talks about the number of people, it talks about what it does. 
it talks about the problems. So some of the questions, so give two control variables in this investigation. Remember, a control variable is something that needs to be kept the same in each time. It talks about the trial being stopped seven months early. So you will need to go and look in the information to go and dig that information. So the answer to that question out. And it might ask if the trial gave reliable results. So go up, look up what we mean by reliable results, and then think, do the results from this investigation give reliable results? If there's anything that you're still unsure about, go back, watch it again, make sure you pause it, and make sure you have a go at the question in the link below.